manga. <laughs> okay, that reminds me, actually. Uh, welcome back to, to Hype Labs, everyone. Welcome back to, welcome back to Flim Flam. Um, welcome so... back to Slim Slam, baby bam. Welcome back to Glonk Hours. <laughs> um, so welcome I... To Hype Labs, after Glonk Hours. So I know you guys don't um, follow F1, but um, something funny happened on yesterday's race. So they were in Jeddah. They were racing in Saudi Arabia, Jeddah. Oh, and never mind them. And no, this is really funny. No, Star trust Wars me. Jedi? No, 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 no. They were before the race started. They they got a band to do the national anthem for Saudi Arabia, and uh, just uh, just t- take a listen. Just just take a listen. Just take a listen. In the words of that one Canadian guy from um, Goon, that was downright treasonous. <laughs> <laughs> but I like the look on George Russell's face. And a Russell's disgrace face. to our proud and storied nation. <laughs> but I like the look on George Russell's face. He's trying his so hard not to laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus fucking Christ. <laughs> fucking beautiful. Oh, uh, shit. Okay, wow. anyway. <laughs> so you talking about videos. I need to be my ringtone. Anyway, welcome back to uh, welcome back to Jetta. Welcome back to Jetta. <laughs> <laughs> uh, pick up the bucket Jeta and jump out the, the window. Confusion and the chaos oh, jump out the window! All yeah. seem to melt away as Stanley embraced the bucket. Stanley ah. dumped the bucket to his cheek. Oh my no! Do I jump out? Oh, uh, you got on the right side. Yeah, you, you had it right. It's a little finicky. Just keep kind of feel feeling around. Right, there you there go. There we go. There we go. And on the computer, and then and then the slam, slam through, and then out the window. See ya, bitch. Yes. Whispered the bucket into Stanley's yes. ear. We've done it. We've, We've escaped from that dull office and that pesky narrator. At last, out here in the white void, we are alone. Now, and for the first time, I can reveal to you my true self. The bucket began to tell Stanley of its life and its history. Of the countless wars it witnessed. What? Desecrating the land and lives of untold numbers of innocent humans. And the bucket's <laughs> own complicity therein. Of sadness and regret and the many years it spent dwelling on the actions it might have taken to curb the madness and the decay, if only it had been stronger. Of hope and redemption, and its crusade to uplift the stock of life for the common man, to manifest justice where none existed, (laughs) and the bittersweet reality of time, to see one's dreams and wishes met halfway, meted out in parcels like charity, (laughs) and abandoned as soon as the warm glow of inspiration begins to dim. The opportunities to I do we're so doing something more. with this blur. There was so much it could like have war done. footage. Perhaps the bucket wondered to itself. Perhaps <laughs> if it had seen its own darkness with a clearer perception. My God. This was it way too much for Stanley. <laughs> what are you talking about? He screamed. You're a bucket. To this, the bucket furrowed its brow. No. <laughs> what bucket. brow? Not since the evil wizard Gamhorata first ensnared me in his machinations as payback for the secret. <laughs> Amulet I stole from his treasure vaults. I was young I back then and could not conceive the ramifications of. No! <laughs> Stanley screamed even louder this time. This is stupid! You are a bucket! This is so stupid! Why are we even doing this? As Stanley screamed and screamed and screamed, the bucket revealed its true form. Transforming into a mighty beast of untold power. <laughs> <It's fangs laughs> this fucking like... blurred will put all the googly eyes and things. My God, Stanley! Holy <laughs> shit! Sages <laughs> in the bucket. Thank God you already had all the twelve <laughs> emblems of sages and knew the incantations to summon. Did we just play through a final, an entire Final Fantasy game in like a span of a minute? Power. Yes. <laughs> no! You've demonstrated yes! such bravery here Help today. Me! Come, let's restart you? the game. You, you look at that right. Never you look at this right. Now hold it at the right angle. Bucket. Put the Final oh, Fantasy no, Seven no, menu. No, yeah. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> oh shit. <laughs> it does, it oh does. no, it's the bucket! It's gone! Run! <laughs> it does look like the Buster Sword. <laughs> <laughs> In the pitch black! Oh god. <laughs> Oh fuck! Okay. I need oh that god. Fucking bucket. Every order. time I, every time I'm gonna open FF7, it's just I'm just gonna see that bucket stabbed by a little room. kitchen knife. Yes, that's where everyone would be. <laughs> Stanley just needed oh, to get to the god. meeting room, and from then on, he would never be alone ever again. Lord, <laughs> I get like the scene from the FF7 remake where Cloud's talking to Sephiroth in the alleyway, but Sephiroth's just like, Cloud, the bucket. <laughs> you must pick it up. <laughs> What are you bastard? What are you talking about? It's yours, Cloud. <laughs> <laughs> you are just only a bucket. You're Mom my bucket. Through Stanley's arms. All right, With let's um. His arms again, he was what I think you want to do, Sam? Um, I don't know. But what happened to the um? Stanley clutched the bucket tightly to his chest. Does anything change if we go in the deluxe stuff? This was not the, the deluxe room again. Yeah, room. I don't think we can go back Stanley in there. Stanley had felt oh, the bucket okay. calling to him. Telling him that the yeah. Emperor oh, Lounge like was simply the place to be. Yeah, yeah. And here it was. Had the bucket turned out to be correct? Was this better? No. How about this mind, time we try the, the confusion, I think, but with the bucket. Stanley took the door on his left to go That's back to the meeting. Down the elevator. Here, take a left here, take the elevator. And so the two of them detoured through the maintenance section and walked straight ahead to the opposite door. Oh, I know this ending. This one's good. This one's funny. Oh, excuse me. Fuck. Oh, that was... That was a... I can't... I'm never gonna get that thought. <laughs> I'm Excuse glad you found your way here. I knew you'd find this place eventually. I'm never gonna get that thought out of my head. <laughs> you see, your friends and I are concerned for you, Stanley. We've come together here because we care <laughs> about you very much. Here. The broom closet, it's the mannequin, that's her wife, the giant her. baby that you the tried to set on even fire. from the original Stanley Parable. It's just sequel content. We're the ones that matter, the Stanley. Adventure line Classic is here, characters from the first game, like the God, Adventure the Line and the it's Broom an intervention. Closet. Because that's what fans want from a sequel. They want more of their favorite jokes, not this bucket that they've never <gasps> seen before. <gasps> Yes, I know I'm the one who Why gave you the bucket, bucket like but you're spending too much time with it. Jesus. Don't you want another it's story bucket. involving like, the adventure wow, line? Wow, <laughs> We could make the adventure line go somewhere new. Yes, yes, that's yes. what the fans we'll want. Let's do it. Hmm? Well, last time we did the adventure line, we were screaming along it, remember? Oh, wait, are we going to have to oh, walk along no, I'm again? good, bro. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> Wee! Look at that wacky line. Who Trademark. knows where it'll go off to Trademark. next? Oh, and it played some Trademark. sweet Trademark. music as well. <laughs> oh yeah, here we go! I remember this! Now this huh. is what the Stanley Parable is oh. all about. You better put the music you back on. All those great jokes from the original dialogue. Also, Stanley is addicted to drugs and hookers. <laughs> <laughs> it's that was a good joke. Now I, I did like that then. Joke. Let's do it for the fans, Stanley. Let's give them more content exactly like this. But if we want to do that, you're going to have to give something up. <laughs> no, to throw away. Bucket. I mean, if if we get the uh, if we get the theme tune back for the adventure line, I'll gladly throw. Don't you get it? <laughs> we need to get rid of the bucket. <laughs> That's why I'm very proud to introduce a brand new character. This is the Bucket Destroyer. <laughs> I think it'll make a wonderful new addition to the rich lore of the Stanley Parable. True, it also was not in Run the away. original game, but it's such a well-fleshed-out character with so much personality that to me, it already feels as though it's been part of the cast all along. Don't you agree? Can you guess what the bucket destroyer does? Why are the person Surely just floating in the air? Spell it out for you. Go ahead now, Stanley. Say goodbye to the bucket, and then Gee. pop it into the machine when you're ready. I mean, if we get if we can get the uh, the music back. Now listen to me. It's crucial that you give it the bucket. I don't know what the bucket destroyer will do if it can't destroy your bucket. Destroying buckets is all it knows. That is its singular personality trait. <laughs> sure, I can hear you saying, how does a character with only what? one personality trait deserve to join the pantheon of beloved Stanley Parable What's it gonna characters? do if we can't destroy the bucket? You see, <laughs> if you were to really explore the bucket destroyer, you would see that its desire to crush buckets is so densely loaded with complexity and nuance that it's really like ten personality traits. <laughs> 
What other object in this game Dang it. can you even say that about? The broom you can't even throw it in there, probably. It's just the kind of stupid <laughs> part. Destroy a merchandise. The fans will be clamoring for after this. Stanley refused. Okay, the bucket destroyer is getting very upset now. You'll have to hurry and feed it. <laughs> we could get back to the Kazakhstan. Yeah, you literally can't Dan, throw it in. Like the adventure line or the bucket destroyer until you crush that damn bucket. Quickly now. The fans <laughs> are waiting. Do it, the fans, Stanley. Give the fans what they want. Hurry and go. <laughs> I don't know what it will do. Uh. Hello? Oh. Bucket destroyer. My prized, prized creation. creation. You had so much, much potential. potential. We were going to do such marvelous things with you. Tell such spell binding stories about you. All of it squandered now. <laughs> Goodbye, new friend. For the moment in time that you were here. You were magnificent. You know what? The Bucket Destroyer is the best character in the game. It didn't even have to do anything to be the best. It just needed to destroy the game at least once. What an ending that was. <laughs> <laughs> the Bucket Destroyer is back. <laughs> and it's calling Chris. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, yeah. Jesus. Don't you love the bucketing? Do we at least do we at least see the bucket destroyer come back? No, it died. Oh damn it! It really was the best character. I'm starting to starting to really hate this thing. I'll tell you what. Yeah. Uh, We've done every ending without the bucket, so might as well keep going with the bucket. Stanley picked up the bucket. It's bucket hours. Yeah. This, is, this is the whole thing. Yeah, I'm not even joking. It's <laughs> not with the bucket around. Let's do. Uh, Stanley clutched the bucket tightly to his chest and entered the door on his left. I don't know. Now this is the problem. We have to remember everything. I, I can. I can remember. It's easy. Uh, let's do. Let's go to the right. Let's um. This was not the correct way to the meeting. Let's do the one where you jump Stanley off on the had catwalk. The where you like really don't listen to him, him. telling oh, him right. that the employee lounge was simply the place to be. So and how is was, so how are you buckets? Bucket turned out to be correct. Uh, oh, no. oh, sorry, I mean mm -hmm. pretty lucky. The bucket was wrong. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> Stanley took the door in his My left. My new favorite to joke. Back to the meeting room. No, said the bucket. Don't go to the meeting room. Go somewhere else. Oh, say, oh. Oh. Stanley feared that any path he walked might lead to the separation of himself and the bucket. <laughs> I mean, it's an ending. I, I so guess. Put it on the list. To his death, that they might die in one another's arms. No, said the bucket. How deep Don't it do it. Him. <laughs> and Stanley fell into the, the bucket. Broke his fall, and Stanley survived. <laughs> and then went back to watch work. it be Stanley Parable 3.0. Even now, Together, Stanley's office was a distant three. memory. <laughs> what did it look like? There was a computer, but the good old... Alright, I guess I'm sorry. I, I legit forgot. I had to get on the on damn... On <laughs> no, you're okay. You gotta get on it, wait till it's together. over the catwalk, and then jump to the Stanley catwalk. Stanley clutched the bucket tightly to his... This was not the correct way to the meeting room, but Stanley had felt the bucket calling to him, telling him that the employee me. lounge was They're taking the, the buckets to Isengard. And here it was. Had the bucket turned out to be correct? No. Never mind. That's an old reference for all you old wrong. Old reference. Stanley took the door on his That's left to go back <laughs> to the meeting room. No, <laughs> said the bucket. Don't, Don't go, go to the, to the meeting, meeting room. room. Go somewhere else. Go go on a cargo room. lift. Yeah. Good, said the bucket. Now ride the lift all the way to the top. There's something up there I need you to do. Stanley did not question why or how this bucket was speaking to him. It should have alarmed him, of course, because so buckets are jumping down there. Yeah, but Stanley the chose not to think about this obvious Walk fact. He was firmly convinced that the bucket had spoken to him, and he unthinkingly did whatever the bucket asked. <laughs> oh yeah, isn't this where like the door, like the, the other doors? doors? Yeah. yeah. No, stop! Look there on the wall. You see, there's a sign right there. It says, "No buckets past this point." <laughs> Stanley, how could you think it was okay to bring the bucket here? Unless, what if the problem is that you actually don't know what is a bucket and what isn't a bucket? That is true. That would oh yeah, this ending. Up to this point, which, if that's true, well, my goodness, I think we have to do something about it. 
This misunderstanding could have dire go consequences on the entire rest of the game. He said about the last one. The it's about to go nuts. So much of the impact of the story is. I mean, you got in a fucking fight with the bucket, you killed it, and then we got the yes. Final Fantasy VII menu screen. That was pretty Please cool. Step in here for a moment. All right. All right, come on. What what you got for me? Is this a bucket? I'm going to run you through some test scenarios, and you'll tell me whether or not the thing I'm showing you is a bucket. <laughs> Simply enough, right? This should All tell right. us everything we'll ever need to know about what is or is not a bucket. Okay, let's begin. <laughs> Item one. Is this a bucket? Can I bullshit this? It doesn't really matter what you do here. <laughs> Just have fun. <laughs> Incorrect. It is a hologram of a bucket, not an actual bucket. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> have fun. Have, have, a, have fun. Item two. Is this a bucket? Let's take a closer... Oh, wait. No, I can't take a closer look. All right. Uh, no. Correct. It is a 3D printed recreation of a bucket. Ah, good eye. Good eye, Sam. Good eye. Ah. Hey, yeah. Good answer. Good answer. <laughs> Family feud. Good answer. Good answer. <laughs> <laughs> Survey <Item> set. <laughs> is this a bucket? <laughs> Survey. <laughs> we asked a hundred married men, "Is this a bucket?" <laughs> Number one answer is show it. <laughs> show <Yeah>. me bucket. <laughs> <laughs> show me bucket. Yay! <laughs> Good answer. Good answer. <laughs> <laughs> Pie in the what? <laughs> Item four. Is this a bucket? What do you think, Sam? <laughs> we asked a hundred thousand rednecks. Is this a bucket? Survey said. Oh! Are you this is a tractor. Really it's an enormous I mean, machine they that tilts the earth. I thought this was a gimmick. How on earth did you manage I mean, to screw it up? I mean, if you carry things from one place to another, incredible. Let's just move it on to the next. In one. an item, and then moving I mean, said item to one place. Open the hood. Put water in Isn't the hood. Isn't it not just a bucket? Is this a bucket? I'm gonna say, look, I'm gonna say yes again. The game's gonna think I'm right. Survey set. Correct. This is a bucket. <laughs> See, that's because they put a bucket inside of it. No, they didn't. <laughs> like, coming up next, my wife. No, wait, it's a bucket. <laughs> is this a bucket? She's like standing, getting me out of here. <laughs> Sally! That's like me inside the bucket. Guys, guys, finally, get me out of here! Get me out of here! Come on, please! No, don't do it! Presto! Presto! Come on! Get me out of here! Welcome to Who it's Wants my final to... chance! Come on! Welcome to Who Wants to Be a Bucket. Is this a bucket? Yeah. Guys? Trick question. Both. You're not getting me out of here? Guys, no, no! Wait, 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 wait! There is a bucket. What do you mean both? A bucket. Okay, that's that's a mind fuck. That's a mind fuck. Right I can't there. find the next one. Let me see. It should be around here somewhere. I don't know if I'm ready for this one. Oh. Is it a bucket? It's right there. Is it a bucket? I mean, we see the bucket on stage. Is, is it a bucket? I, is it a bucket? I survey set? Oh, I think. Okay. You and I both know there isn't anything here. Yeah, there is. And I Look. don't appreciate the implication that nothing is a bucket when we both clearly know that a bucket is something, and therefore nothing could possibly be something. But there's Unless a bucket in your right twisted there. Mind, have you somehow convinced yourself that a bucket is nothing? Answer me straight, Stanley. Do you believe that nothing is a bucket? No, no, no. I was saying the bucket's right there. You know what? I'm too confused to even sort it out. I've lost all sense of perspective. What is a bucket? What isn't a bucket? Mere moments ago, I could answer these questions with confidence. And yet now I'm somewhat adrift. Do any of us know what a bucket is? Am I a bucket? We're all buckets at heart. Stanley, I can't keep doing this. I'm losing myself, and myself was all I ever had to begin with. I think we're I'm all afraid the bucket the is threatening to tear our relationship apart. Hey now, I can't help that. I'm sorry. Get your but I'm going you, to erase get, get all buckets in. from the game Go. entirely. <clears throat> okay. Twang. I don't know what sound does a bucket make when you hit it with something. Glonk. Glonk! <laughs> anyway, Sam, you're the bucket now. Is everything gone? Why did everything disappear? Wait. Because everything was is everything a, bucket. a bucket. Every single thing in the game was a bucket. 
My God, I had no idea. I was the bucket the whole time! It's me. <laughs> I'm not a bucket after all. And you, Stanley, you're still here. You're not a bucket either. Oh, this is I'll, wonderful. I'll uh, give We're one dollar to the person who can uh, find yes, that reference. I actually feel much more. I need to. Right I need now. to show you the, to the get some AI generated issue, YouTube. But it doesn't that, change um, the fact that we haven't got a game. That has clips from so that in it. tell you what, <laughs> from my video. Yeah. Oh my God! No we'll way. <laughs> yeah, it's really buckets, fucking funny. Okay? And we'll the know program that was against you for a minute. I kept calling you shit. If you run into anyone else, maybe don't mention that. Who knows what that information might do to a person? All right, here we go. So that was it. We were just it was we were just all everything bucket. is a bucket. <laughs> okay. The ending. Is this a bucket? I think I think we can clearly say that yes, everything is a bucket. Alrighty. Uh, I can't wait to tell this story to my co-workers, Stanley Thor. How many have we got? Left? They'll find it. Oh, oh. won't we all just laugh and laugh at the time I thought everyone had got? Where are we going today? The bucket asked. Stanley this just is really smiled. the uh, the Anywhere bucket saga, the bucket would be trilogy. Stanley clutched the bucket tightly to his chest uh, and entered the door. Uh, Take your pick, and I'll tell you what to do. This was not the correct All right, way to the let's meeting do... room. <gasps> oh, I just remembered another ending without the bucket. Telling him that the employee lounge. Was... Anything without the bucket. <laughs> <laughs> let's take a quick break from the bucket, and then after that, it's bucket hours. After bucket hours. All right, so this one's a little weird. Uh, you're Stanley gonna knew the office layout like the You're gonna not hand. listen to the narrator. It was only a matter of time to the point where you get the to the lift, but you're not gonna get on the lift, okay? Just a matter right. of time. All right, speed run. What does a Stanley Parable speed run look like? <laughs> when Stanley came to a set no, 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 of two no, 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 no. doors, he entered the door on his. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, that up. and Stanley knew it perfectly. Well. <laughs> I, I thought you said Perhaps listen to him. I said don't listen to him to the point where you get to the cargo lift, just to admire it. Stanley felt <laughs> lightheaded, <laughs> butterflies in his stomach, but eager to get back to business. But eager Stanley to find his the bucket. first open door on his left. All right. Stanley was so now you directions. see it's this on the left here. So don't go on the left. Don't go on the left. Don't go on the left. Go, on the left. go back. You the see the, the little ramp on the boxes. Walk off the ledge and land on that little pile of boxes there. You see that path of boards. Ew. Follow that. Another Stanley. Ring. Another miniature Stanley figurine. This um. There is actually an ending here really though. Must be a right. snappier name for these things. What about? Mini stands, Stanley figs. Um, what about Stanlerines? Yes, Stanlerines. I think I like that. Another Stanlerine under your belt. <laughs> All right, now turn around and go back on this path, and you see there's a hole in the wall there. Hello. Go on your little adventure. Okay. Anything without the bucket, I'm good. Stanley had now gotten himself so far off the beaten path that it seemed the office had begun from so far off the beaten path that it seemed the office had begun from so far off the beaten path that it seemed the office had begun from so far off the beaten path that it seemed the office had begun from so far off the beaten path. Oh no, we're getting into it. From so far off the beaten path that it seemed the office had begun. You didn't think I was actually just a recording, did you? <laughs> <laughs> All the back and forth between you and me, all the absurd adventures we've been through, and it all turns out I'm just a tape recording? It was all just in Stanley's head. I bet that's the kind of twist you think is revelatory. I bet each and every time you watch a movie where it turns out all to be in the main character's imagination, you must absolutely bolt off the couch in pure shock <laughs> at the phenomenal and intricate storytelling. It must be so Hey, American Psycho ruled. Shut the fuck up. Life being it. an unending cool. waterfall of surprises <laughs> and delights. I don't think the whole part, more the whole movie was just in his head. The, the part story. where he shoots the cop car and it explodes yeah. and he's like... Now I've become sad. Look what you've done to That's me. That's in his head, because he's like, how'd that happen? <laughs> Still don't know what you're talking about. Anyway. Have you seen the movie Velocipaster? Or Spaghetti Man? Or no. Ghost Shark? Ghost Shark. Ghost Shark. Or Sand Shark? Shark anyway, that, shark that, that, that was actually the last ending without the... Um, the bucket. Oh, we're legit out of endings without I the bucket? I think we're out of endings without the bucket. All of his co-workers um, were gone. What could it mean? 
So Stanley decided to go to the how meeting many room. Do we Perhaps have he had left? simply asked um, a memo. I'm, I'm not gonna lie, I'm trying to brace myself for the last ending we have so we can just, you know, say, We're done! And then just do something really stupid. I don't know how many we have left. Let's keep going. Uh, <laughs> um, I do know there's a bit at some point where you uh, a bucket, a you run bucket, into the uh, the, the, bucket, th the thing from the, in the beginning bucket, of the game that talks to you every time it's like adjust these sliders. You actually bucket, find that chest, thing again and it starts talking to you and then it says like we're gonna make the Stanley Parable three <laughs> and then it, and then it ends. <laughs> That's when I stop playing. Oh, um, why don't you? Go to the left. Wasn't there like an ending where we saw like what the beta prototype would be? Let me let me explain a little further. Essentially, there was uh, buildings, except it was like the buildings were not fully uh, finished. You could say coming to a stand. Like so. Standing in that. the bucket. Oh, you can also go down here. To the remember that ending? Office. I vaguely remember that. Yeah. Oh, hello. Okay, I'm going back to the name of these little Stanley figurines. Yes. And now I'm torn between Stanlerines and Figlies. What do you figlies. think, Stanley? Put your votes in the comments the and then smash that like button and ring that bell. That you get um, bring that bucket. Bring that bucket. That was a good one. <laughs> Today's episode is all about the bucket. Make sure you smash that bucket. <laughs> Hey, yo, at least you take out to dinner first? Damn. <laughs> but Stanley just I was like, the ring that bucket kind of caught me off guard. Boss, admitting he had left his post during work hours. He might be fired for that. And in such a competitive economy, why had he taken that risk? All because he believed everyone had vanished? His boss would think he was crazy. But I'm and holding the bucket. Something occurred to Stanley. Maybe, he thought to himself, maybe I am crazy. He looked down at the bucket in his arms. Am I crazy? He asked the bucket. <laughs> no. The bucket returned his gaze, but said nothing at all. Isn't that strange, Stanley thought. Usually the bucket is a source of guidance and wisdom for me. In difficult times, such as... <laughs> it does. Uh, usually car down here, he held the bucket Yeah, honestly, it's, it's kind of a weird of place to park your car. You have to walk through all these rooms, and then all of a sudden you turn around, and this it's isn't just... Bucket. It's just a okay, so hold on a second. Everyday bucket. It's not someone my bucket. bucket but the brakes are on. I and someone's in that someone car. else's bucket. This is all terribly wrong. The Surely no what would come from this. Who knows what sorts of bizarre hallucinations Stanley might experience without the psychologically grounding presence of his bucket. The bucket go? Keep looking Indeed. for the bucket. Now Keep looking for the bucket. The rooms were repeating, which was, of course, very odd. And now he felt himself floating off the ground. Oh, gracious. <gasps> He exclaimed, without my bucket, I've gone truly mad. <laughs> I've Where turned to God. I must find it. <laughs> Far off in the distance. I am dead. Calling to <laughs> I don't know what's Stanley. going on. Stanley, it's me, the bucket. <laughs> Could it truly be? He rushed forward from the ah! room, passing by one bucket after the next. None of them were his. None of them were his special bucket. <laughs> oh my god, the buckets. Could you imagine if you come back to the room with the car and it's just a giant had bucket? To find the bucket. <laughs> he had to return to his old friend. The car made it was of the buckets. only way to truly restore his sanity. And then suddenly, <laughs> get in the bucket and drive. He knew where the get voice of the bucket go had find. been coming from. The real bucket was inside of him all along. No! It was incredibly painful. Stanley God, I need doubled to over so hard right now. and blacked out. I just saw a big bucket in there. <laughs> the big bucket shadow, yeah. <laughs> this is the story of a woman named Mariella. Oh, God. On this Remember again. this bit? Oh, Mariella this woke again. up on a day like any other. Yeah, this is where we see them dead in the street. Picked up her bucket of comfort and security. <laughs> and it's the same thing, but now she has a bucket. <laughs> <laughs> This is the Stanley Parable 2. This is all it is. It's just bucket jokes. Town, talking and screaming to himself, and then collapsed dead on the sidewalk. Right away, she knew what the problem was. He didn't have his bucket. Had no bucket. <laughs> hey, you found the joke, Sam. <laughs> it's crazy. Ranting and raving about a narrator describing all of his actions and how everything is predetermined and free will is an illusion and it's all just a video game. It could all have been prevented if only he'd taken his bucket with him. <laughs> Perhaps he didn't even realize he'd forgotten his bucket at home in the first place. I, I don't know how much, much more I could take any of this bucket. bucket even 
I'm enjoying it. I mean, course, we can end the LP whenever you want, Sam. Honestly, this is the Stanley Parable. It kind of just keeps going. Front at work, for which her bucket would provide <laughs> there are more endings with the bucket, but it is up to you. Mine kicks ass. And she backflipped all the way to work. Lord, we'll get like three backflipping gifts. Go. Wee. Wee. <laughs> One more. Whoa. Whoa. That was four. Okay. What, what, what time are we at? 30 minutes. Okay. 31 minutes. But you know what that means. Next time on Hype Labs, Blurgeld is a black... Whoa. A black... 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 A black...